Hi, welcome to another Simply Diagnostic video from from a bright and sunny Cheshire today. Um, we're in a bright and sunny Preston. We are at ADS Limited, Petrol Street, Preston, the VAG Group Premier Independent Specialist in the country. So um, we've been asked to come come over. Um, and we're having a look at an Audi SQ5 with a daylight, daytime running light issue, side light issue. So let's show you what we've got. Hey, what practical, how are we, mate? <laughs> so we're in the beautiful workshops at ADS. Dave's been getting stressed out about the state of his floor. He's been running around with his carcher cleaner all morning. Hey, what Ryan, this smell tea bag, Michael, how are you? And we're on this beautiful Audi SQ5. Michael Blanchard? Uh, no, Mike Bet Betnier. And who's this beautiful person here? You'll all know him. <laughs> David from ADS Automotive Auto Inform. How are you, Dave? <laughs> I'm all right, mate. I'm all right. What? Hello to all the viewers. <laughs> what are you doing there, mate? What are you doing on floor, hands and knees? Oh, well. <laughs> <laughs> is, is weekend finished? <laughs> <laughs> I'm... Uh, I'm um, I'm working on this bastard, I mean beautiful Audi SQ, did I say bastard then? No, uh, no, Beautiful no. SQ5, that's got a, a DRL light running, a daytime running light issue. Yeah. Um, what we suspect happened with this, there's been an issue with one of the ballasts for daytime running lights. It's pulled on the warning of the dash. Now, I've had it before, obviously you have an issue with one of the modules on the network. If it doesn't talk to it for so long, it'll, it'll uncode itself from the gateway, right. which is handy. So we've just had to mess around with the gateway coding. Yeah. Isolated it to the front left module, which yep. I've got here. Yeah. I'm going to put it on now, uh, ensure the coding's right, and then we're going to turn lights on. Hopefully, we'll have, we'll have to see in the dark. Awesome. Hopefully. Awesome. Hopefully. <laughs> we've had a full, full English breakfast. We've had black pudding, mm. bacon, sausage, double egg, ash brown, a round of toast. Tomato. Tomato, beans. beans, mushrooms, toast, uh, toast, and the toast, two cups of tea. <laughs> uh, you have a little lie down for about an hour and we'll do some more work and then maybe mid afternoon siesta. Who knows? Awesome, we like that. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Dave. <laughs> Yeah, brilliant. Yes, we got the as as per normal. Got the the far side tablet out. Nice, quick, easy. Great, rugged. I like tablet. that. I really like that. It's good, isn't I it? Love it yeah. yeah. First time I've used it. Yeah. Um, Very nice. Pico 4425A, you all know that by now. It's me, me new baby. Never leave home without it. If you don't know me. <laughs> and the <by> awesome <laughs> fused um, ground breakout lead you from, from SME Creations. ALP is singing me. now. <laughs> no, you won't. <laughs> so, what we're actually doing here, we're looking at the, um, the control signal for the DRLs. Um, obviously, uh, this is off. This is ig uh, ignition on, DRL's on, and then when we turn the side lights on, all of a sudden, we get like a, a duty called PWM signal. Hey, help Kevin, AJ, Andy. We get like a PWM signal here, which is uh, strange, and the, the side lights then don't work. They don't illuminate. So we're thinking that maybe there's actually no current flow there. We're actually thinking that that's just a, a parity check, a circuit check, because the side lights are definitely not illuminating. So we're gonna change this ballast resistor. Zoom me out of it, so you can see where we're working. We're working down there in the in the bowels. You can see where we're, we're probed in there into the white black. When you say we're working? Well, we're, yeah, I'm filming well, you're working. What do you mean where we're working? Is that like a royal <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Well, my, uh, my, my, yeah, my, my yes. knees are still clean. <laughs> Myself and my technician here, my apprentice, is <laughs> on his hands and knees. Uh. <laughs> yeah, so through that you can see Dave working there through Queen. the wheel arch liner. <laughs> Yeah, my knees are clean and dry. <laughs> First time for everything, Steve. There is. <laughs> so, so, oh, oh, that's got him. Oh, oh COVID. <clears throat> I've gone and have a ciggy now. Yeah. Don't Sorry. forget, we, you notice we're observing uh, social distancing. When we're together or any danger of social distancing, then I put my handily purchased from my Teespring store Simply Dag face mask on. I've brought condoms. With custom fitting <laughs> kit. So so we are observing safety precautions, uh, sanitisation, all that. So you don't need to worry about that. I'm not taking COVID home to mummy. So 
thanks for watching guys if we get a fix we'll go live again later but thanks for watching thanks for watching you're awesome do it again mate what's that say it again yeah you're awesome that's it <laughs> <laughs> thanks for watching thanks, guys. you're awesome